take this dude and maybe help him with his bridge work, like busting up his mouth. Hey, B.A., that's very funny. You know, you're developing a sense of humor. Slowly, but uh, it's developing. Okay, face you, Spring Murdoch. We'll regroup at BA as soon as I get off the shift. Enjoy the rest of the tour. Bread and butter. And I thought the guy in the Chinese laundry was crazy. Jim Murdoch's room. Well, I guess I found it. Well, um, he, he started up earlier this morning, but we're used to this sort of behavior with Mr. Murdoch. But he's gotten much worse. I mean, if I didn't know better, I'd actually believe he has been bitten in his contracted rabies. Nurse, believe it. Oh, but that, that's not possible. You see, Mr. Murdoch's dog is a figment of his imagination. Oh, I'm sorry, doctor, I don't know you, and apparently you're not familiar oh, with this because, case. Oh, that's because I'm not a doctor. The United States Department of Animal Health and Welfare? Mm -hmm. One of your superiors was aware of the impending epidemic and uh, didn't want to take any chance. He's crazy. He's gone. He's foaming at the mouth and everything. I can't believe it. He has never been this violent he before. Me. He bit you? Oh, I'm going to have to have you in for an entire series of blood scans and uh, full rabies and tetanus board. Uh, could you get me that uh, wheelchair, please? Thanks. How can he have rabies? I mean, his dog isn't real. From animals that uh, escaped last night. From Germany. Came in on a Lufthansa flight. They're supposed to be transported under airtight security to the Wadsworth Research Facility. Could you grab the door, please? Now. Easy, easy, easy. Whoa, whoa. Easy, easy. Get on the chair. Good. Okay, open up. Uh, could you step inside, please? Come on, come on, step inside. That's right, that's right. Uh, keys? Come on, it's for your own good. I want you to uh, remain in quarantine until I can check back with you in a couple of days. Hopefully by then I'll have developed the serum you'll need. And uh, you're to speak of this to no one except Nurse Billings. Hmm? Uh, contact me immediately should he develop any strange symptoms, such as the desire to scratch behind his ears. Wait, wait, Mr. Murdoch is a patient here. I can't just release him to someone from the pound. We happen to be a division of the federal government. I'm working in conjunction with the Department of Health Services, which gives us jurisdiction over any and all state institutions. So please, please be careful before coughing up the word pound like that. And I need not remind you to speak of this to no one. Ah, all hospitals in this... Easy, boy, easy, easy. All hospitals in the city have been uh, warned of the possible outbreak. Oh, well, uh, hopefully Mr. Murdoch's condition was caught in time and you can develop a serum. Yeah, well, we hope. <laughs> This man could single-handedly save the entire population of uh, Los Angeles. Oh, boy! Do you understand? This is Denim's last offer. You got till tomorrow to think it over. After that, the offer's no good. And then we're gonna have to do it the hard way. Just what do you think you're doing? What are you doing here? Get off of this lot! I just do what Mr. Denham tells me to. No, on this lot, you do what I tell you to do. Now, get out of here. I was just being kind enough to offer up jobs to anyone who wants them. When Denham Construction takes over this contract. Denham Construction's not taking over this contract, and these men are on my payroll. What payroll? You guys finished signing the roster? What are you expecting to do, Mick? They all got families. Damn, can't keep him working. 
can also keep my unemployment. All right, you said your piece. Now, Denham doesn't have this contract yet, so you take those ugly guys of yours and get them out of here. When I'm finished, old man. Don't you call Uncle Mickey! The man said go. I take my orders from Denham. Be smart. Do the same. You guys look like you can work steel pretty well. Sign in. You're on the roster. You got anything else you want us to chew over? Maybe you should let some of the boys tell you what can happen to you if you work this job for Stern. I'd rather you told me. Almost predictable by now, isn't it? You're never late for anything. You did a good job. Murdoch, what are you doing? I'd say it was just an